Okay guys, I filmed a Insta tutorial and I want to show you in depth what I did. Right now I am using e.l.f.'s lip scrub. I freaking love it. And what it does, it um, exfoliates your lips but it also kind of plumps them because you're like not irritating them but you're exfoliating them. And I'm using Aveeno's um, aloe coconut stuff. It's amazing. I love it. Now I'm putting on NYX Wonder Pencil and I'm just using that as a base. And now I'm just getting a straight edge from a foundation bottle. It's just easier that way. And I'm starting to blend uh, like a transition color. It's just easier if you do it that way first. Now I'm using Mermaid Mousse for the face from uh, Million Dollar Tan. This stuff like really bronzes up your skin, but not too much. And it's a great primer. It like, the foundation really sticks to it. I really, really like this stuff. Just blend it into your hairline. And now I'm using LA Girls Almond Concealer as a um, contour. And yeah, I'm just gonna blend that in. Now I'm using Becca's Eye Brightener. This is the shit if you have um, dark circles. It's so good. It brightens up my dark circles, but it's not so much that it covers them, it just brightens that area. And now I'm using Ofra's Contour Kit, and I'm just using the yellow shade because it's gonna cancel out any green tones too. Make sure you really blend this stuff because it can get a little streaky, especially if you're looking right now, you're gonna be like, oh my God, she's crazy. So go ahead and blend it a lot and it will come out okay, I promise. A lot of people do extreme contour way differently, but what I do is I'll do my extreme contour and then I'll put my foundation over it so it's not so extreme because my skin is very pale. Um, so I just like to, I feel like it just looks better if I put my foundation over it. It's not as strong and it blends way better. So you guys should try that tip and let me know how it works out for you. Now I'm using my Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer and I just feel like it really brightens up my under eyes and um, next I'm going to use the NYX Banana Powder to set it and I'm going to set that with my whole face too with a big um, setting brush. I'm really going to use a lot of bronzer all over my face just to bronze myself up. Also, I'm using Milani's blush in Luminoso. It's like the perfect peach and it kind of bronzes you up too if you have a fair skin tone. Now I'm using Gerard Cosmetics BB Illuminator. This is so good for a base for a um, highlighter. And then right after that, I'm gonna go ahead and set it with their Audrey highlighter. It's just so beautiful and it gives like a glowing effect from within. I love it. Now I'm putting on Gerard Cosmetics Immortal Liquid Lipstick and I my lips were just so dry today that I didn't like a matte liquid lipstick so I went over it with the Balm's Boom Lip Liner or I'm sorry lip gloss and it was like perfect. I loved that combo but I feel like this look I did like a million videos on this look on my channel so don't get mad at me. So this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Sorry that it's a talk through. This was just supposed to be for Instagram, but I had enough footage for um, a YouTube video. And sorry about my mic because it is in the headphones of like the iPhone headphones and I don't have a mic yet. So bear with me.